hi everyone welcome to this session so let's solve uh, this problem okay so basically we have uh, like here given that uh, a transfer function and there is two poles and one zero and their location is also given okay so now we need to find the what is the 3db frequency uh, of the circuit okay so how do we solve this so actually we need a body body plot right uh, to solve this type of question so we have body phase plot and we have body magnitude plot right but uh, okay one thing so so when we do body magnitude or phase plot so we have like this right actually one thing you should know whenever we do like body phase or magnitude plot uh, normally we have given that all the all the poles and zeros are uh, left up plane okay left up plane uh, roots okay but in this case we can see that the zero is at right up plane okay so this is the right up plane zero so actually uh, for bode bode magnitude plot okay for bode magnitude plot does uh, right up plane zero right half plane zero contribute nothing okay like the left half plane zero and the right up plane zero contribute same thing in bode magnitude plot okay and uh, what about the phase of for right up plane uh, zero so actually when we know that if you, we have a left up plane zero left up plane zero then the phase plot is feels uh, plus 45 degree phase shift right uh, at that frequency and for right up plane zero right up plane zero if a for right up plane zero it feels opposite okay so it will lag the phase so this will contribute minus 45 degree okay so this is the like changes but normally we are when we do body plot we know that all the quantities are in left up plane okay and similar thing when we have a right up plane right up plane pole so it it affects on body body magnitude plot okay it doesn't affect body phase plot okay like the body phase plot for this right up plane zero uh, feels the same way like it will uh, give minus 45 degree phase shift but in this case if we have a right up plane pole uh, for this body magnitude plot so minus 20 db is the normal case for uh, for a left up plane pole but for a right up plane board it will contribute plus 20 db per decade okay so this is the thing you need to know so now we have to draw the body magnitude magnitude plot first okay so we can see that at the same frequency let's say 10 mega rand mega radian per second okay so this is let's say mega rad per second okay unit so we can see that uh, at 10 mega rad we have both a pole and a zero pole is at left up plane this is a minus sign and zero is at uh, at right up plane because this is a plus so what do you think at 10 at 10 mega radian what would be the uh, body uh, body plot slope basically for this for this body like for this pole it will try to decrease like that right minus 20 db per decade and for this zero it will try to increase plus 20 db per decade slope right so what what would be the effective effect so basically it will remain intact right by basically it will remain the same the uh, the gain will be like this okay the pole is trying to decrease min like the pole is trying to give minus 20 db per decade slope and the zero is trying to give plus 20 db per decade slope so actually this slope doesn't changes okay so it will remain constant so we can if we have this 10 mega rand so here here it will remain same okay up to that and then it feels a 100 mega rand pole 2 okay so then it will get a minus 20 db per decade okay so this is minus 20 db per decade and this is our 100 100 mega rand okay so this is the this is how the body body magnitude plot will look like okay but what about the body body phase plot so we know that at this frequency at this frequency there is a right up plane uh, zero and a left up plane pole so both will affect the like the zero will affect the phase right so instead of making plus 45 degree for the zero 
it will give minus 45 degree at this pole at this zero frequency because this is a right up plane this is a right up plane zero okay so actually in this case this will reach to minus 90 degree okay minus 90 for what uh, minus 45 degree is for uh, pole one and minus 45 degree is for zero z on okay so this is a left up plane uh, left up plane zero and this is a uh, sorry this is a left up plane pole and this is a right up plane zero. so at at that frequency 10 megahertz per second it will uh, feel minus for uh, minus 90 degree uh, phase shift okay and then again so it will it uh, and 10 times of this uh, 10 times of this frequency it will go to minus 180 almost okay and then there is another pole at 100 100 megahertz okay so it will go another so at that frequency it will get it will almost go to okay let me do so if we do that so there will be minus 180 minus 45 so 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 this will be this point will be minus uh, minus 225 okay and eventually it goes to minus 270 so this will be our this will be our bode phase plot but we need to find the 3 db bandwidth right so actually here in this case we no need to no need this plot okay from this we can directly comment the what, what will be the 3 db frequency so basically we can see that this is a bode magnitude plot and it is having single pole behavior right because we can see that there is a only uh, only on uh, uh, decaying slope this is minus 20 db per decay so basically this circuit is actually behaving like a single pole system okay and we know that the single pole in for single pole system the uh, like the pole the, the pole frequency is the 3 db frequency pole frequency is nothing but the 3 db frequency or 3 db bandwidth okay 3 db bandwidth so what will be the case here so we can see that this is the like the the effective pole is that right from here the slope is decaying uh, as minus 20 db per decade right so basically the effective pole is this 100 megahertz okay so this will be our final answer so basically what happening here is uh, the bode magnitude plot is like a normal single order circuit or single pole system so we know that the uh, for single order system the pole frequency is the 3 db bandwidth of the circuit so here we can see that the 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 circuit feels minus 20 db per decade from 100 megahertz per second so this is our effective single pole okay so this is the effective pole so the our 3 db bandwidth will be minus uh, like 100 megahertz per second okay so this is the answer so you can uh, give your valuable feedbacks okay thank you